greatest number that you'll ever do. Ladies and gentlemen, Johnny Farnham. John, you are what the best voice. singer in the country. Johnny That's Farnham. the voice. Everybody, welcome back to Grandparents React. I'm Wanda and I'm Ricky, and we're excited once again to be on this journey of exploring music and musicians from all around the world. Yep, I'm scrolling a list now of all the different countries we've already reacted to music from, yep. and just having a great time discovering new music. And hope you're discovering new music right along with us. Sure do. And tonight we're going to be talking about John Farnham. He is an Australian singer that we reacted to recently when he did uh, uh, Help from uh, the Beatles. That was good. It was. And it was our first introduction to him. And of course, the very first time we react to any artist, we go in blind. We don't do any sort of research. So we didn't know what, where he was from or anything about him. But boy, oh boy. <laughs> Have our viewers been at, been coming on and telling us all about him? Yep. He's evidently very famous, big star. Yep. He was a a um, like a teen heartthrob from 1967. Wow. Back then, he they called him Johnny Farnham, and um, until '79, he was billed as Johnny Farnham. And uh, has had some big hits. He even was, uh, for a while, from 1982 to 86, he was with the uh, Little River Band. Yep. Which we've heard of them. Yeah, I've heard of them. So, <laughs> and, um, and you know, when we reacted to Help, we were used to the Beatles version. Right. So it's like, he sings really good. You know, you can tell the crowd loves him. But it's like, you know, do we really like that version? Because we were so used to the, the Beatles, Beatles version. And I was a big Beatles fan. Yes. But, you know, people, I hadn't even really thought about that being a sad song. But it really is. He's crying out for help. Yeah. And people have told us that originally John Lennon had wanted that to be a slow song, like John Farnham did it. Mm. But that, um, you know, they put the pressure on him to do it as a, a pop song, a beat pop song. So that's what we're used to. Right. And so when you really think about the song in, from that light, then the John Farnham version seems to be more appropriate. And people have, a lot of people have come into our comments and told us that, that John Lennon said, that's the way I wanted it. And he liked it. He liked John Farnham's version, and evidently it came out just a little bit before uh, John Lennon was killed. Well, but, John Lennon, he knows music. Oh, yeah. Definitely. So that was very interesting information, and we really appreciate our viewers giving us all that information. Yeah. So tonight, we're actually going to be looking at a trailer, official trailer, for, for a movie that they did about John Farnham. It's called The Voice, or Finding the Voice. And some of our viewers had requested that we actually uh, react to this this trailer. So stick around to the end. We'll give that person a shout out yeah. for, and thank them for, for making this recommendation. And we're definitely wanting to do some more reaction to some more John Farnham music. Yeah. And we've already gotten a lot of recommendations. If you all will go into the comments and tell us your recommendations, we will be reacting to more of his music very soon. Right. I wanted to read, though, some of the comments that uh, people have made that we, you know, it's really funny. Hold on just a second here. All right. So, uh, the first one was Martin Unwin. He says, fine review by a fine appreciative lady and a guy who I thought had just died. <laughs> <laughs> LOL. I'm a grandparent too, but take my happy pills every day. Yeah. And we got the biggest kick out of that comment. We were I get a lot of laughing. comments about being dead. 
<laughs> his grandpa still breathing. And then we had somebody else come in and say, this is from uh, Pierre, and I'm going to try to pronounce his last name, Verschuren. I probably mispronounced. I guarantee I mispronounced it. But his comment is, is Grandpa dead? <laughs> <laughs> and put a little smiley face on there. And then Ann Bowman came in and wrote, definitely not a happy camper. <laughs> oh, no. They don't know you, do they? No. <laughs> this is the happiest, most pleasant guy I've ever known. And then uh, Pierre came back in and said, I did see a slight movement. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, Man, we love. They're ready to put me ground. <laughs> <laughs> we love to laugh, and we can definitely laugh at ourselves. I we love these comments. We had one of our other viewers come in on that one and say, "Hey, you guys shouldn't be making fun of him. He's got health problems and stuff." But I said, "That's okay. It, it gave us a good life, and I think it brought Grandpa back to life." <laughs> <laughs> so that was that was a lot of fun. But we we love you guys' comments. Come in and tell us what you think. Yes, it's okay, even if it's uh, some. Some people really were not happy that we didn't react more positively to his version of help, and that's fine. We definitely want to hear from you and your comments. But anyway, we're definitely we're looking forward to learning more about him. Hopefully, we'll get a little bit of snippets from this uh, official trailer. And then if you guys will go into the comments and give us some more recommendations for that'd be great. music that you want to do, that'd be great. All right. You ready to do this? I'm ready. Okay. We're going to do a quick uh, little break for our, our uh, sponsor, less than a minute, like 40, 43 seconds or something along, and then we'll be right back. Hey, everybody. Our video reaction will start in just a minute. First, we want to tell you about my new scooter. Y'all, because of Grandpa Ricky's neuropathy and issues after experiencing two strokes, there are days that it just isn't safe for him to walk very far. This mobility scooter from Vosik has been a game changer, opening doors for us to do so much more and go more places. Also, it is lightweight. I am able to lift it in and out of the car by myself. Look in the description of this video to find out how you can get one and how you can get an additional discount off of the already low price. All right, let's get back to our reaction video. Here we go. Music Look at is that so crowd. important to us. There was something about his voice that was just so appealing. His voice was incredible. He can heal you. People just worshipped him. It fills in the gap where religion should be. You can feel their voice. Who the hell is this guy? It is a heroic story. It can go straight to somebody's heart. number that you'll ever do ladies and gentlemen johnny what Farnham. a voice johnny, johnny Farnham. you are the best singer in the country that's the voice either i was working or i was asleep so when i was awake i was vulnerable people never really saw me as a credible singer do you like the i remember coming off the stage one night and he punched the locker door and he smashed it in she said let's take robert to mcdonald's for dinner and i actually couldn't take them we didn't have the money he was pretty much broke do you ever get depressed at all yeah a lot i tried to get him a record deal and everybody passed we lost track of john his spectacular voice was missing in action the story of Glenn's belief in John is legendary. This was John's almost audition to the world again. My publishing company said, John Farnham has recorded You're the Voice. Is it okay to give him permission? And I said, no. We went ahead and did it anyway. Really, oh. they weren't supposed to record it, but they did. And he sang the living hell out of that song. Awesome. And that became the one. Number one in West Germany this week, number one in Sweden, roaring up the French and Italian charts. Oh my god, he's found his voice. This is dangerous. He won't surrender. You don't like to think of yourself as a legend, but you are. Oh wow. That's pretty cool. It really was cool, and I'm looking forward to getting into more of his music. You know? And uh, like I said, we've already had a, a lot of uh, suggestions, and we will definitely be doing some yeah. soon. But you all go into the comments, and we'll be giving you a shout out if you uh, are one of the suggestions that we end up being able to do. But um, 
Yeah, I have a feeling there's going to be a lot of, of songs that we recognize that he did. Um, now, people were saying that um, he never did hit big in the United States. And uh, he even came here and they just billed him in a small venue and mispronounced his name announcing him. And he was like, just going back home to Australia and that way I'm spending time with my family and that's where he concentrated his love of music. And it sounds like the Australians were thrilled with that. Yeah. So uh, definitely looking forward to this. Um, if you will, when you're when you're commenting and telling us other songs to do, tell us where you're from. Yeah, because we keep a list of people from all around the world. We do. We just get a kick out of it hearing from people oh, from yeah. all over, and and uh, we whenever that somebody says I'm watching from this place or I'm from the, this other place, I add that place to our list, and we've got a list that's like 450 places long of all the different cities, states, countries, regions that people have said they're watching from or that they're from. It's and these people that that have commented from there have only, it's about all with good uh, positive reactions. Sure, people. yeah, definitely. Kind of, we, definitely. Got, we got some good people. We got some great viewers and great subscribers and uh, really appreciate that. If you'll stick around to the end of this video and after video will play and at the beginning of that video I'll scroll the list as of today all the different places we've heard from and we just yeah. we, we do get a kick out of that. Um, I'm not sure how many edits I'll have to do to this video to make sure I'm not infringing on any copyright restrictions here on YouTube but our full reaction video will go up right away on our Patreon account and that's at patreon.com slash grandparents react. Yep. I'm scrolling a list now of the few patrons that we already have and those people because they support us by becoming a patron they get full access to all of our videos right yeah, away. We appreciate everyone of you. We do. We so much do. I'm scrolling their names now. And we've also just recently started a membership here on uh, YouTube. And you click that join button. Um, you can become a member. And those folks also get access to our videos right yeah. away. But we will have this video up onto YouTube as soon as possible. There's few edits as possible. It's always free to watch there. And we really appreciate it when you do. If you all liked our reaction tonight, be sure and give us the thumbs up, which is the like button that helps promote this particular video. Yep. If you haven't done so already, subscribe to our channel. It doesn't cost anything to subscribe. Yeah, and share this video. Yep. yep. We really appreciate you for doing all of that. And um, we want to give a shout out to the person who recommended oh, this yeah. particular video. I'm just calling their name on the screen now. Thank you so much. Appreciate that it. That does give us a little more insight into who John Farnham is. Yep. And um, also, um, want to make sure you all know that Jesus loves you. And we love you too. We do. Thanks, everybody. Peace. You're still here? It's over. Are y'all still here? <laughs> Thanks everybody for sticking around. Uh, since you did, let's talk some more about what's going on with uh, Grandparents React. Yeah. Um, I'm scrolling a list now of all the different uh, countries and cities and states and places that people have gone into our comments and given us a shout out. And we really love our viewers. We really appreciate you guys. Have You guys have, have introduced us to so much new music. And we're just having a great time with that. Yep. And, uh, yeah, if you'll go into our comments and tell us where you're from, that'd be cool. But just uh, to chat with us on the, on the comments, we get a kick out of that. We read every comment and try to respond to all of them and keep a list of all the recommendations people give us. Really having a good time with that. Um, as we said earlier in the video, um, sometimes we have to do special video edits. We, when we first started our channel, there were times that we would stop the music, but we just really, the music's the important part. Yeah. And so we just, now we just let the music roll. And sometimes people go in the comments and say, but if you'll stop it real often, then They'll let you monetize it. It'll get past the, the restrictions on the copyrights. 
but we're, we're just not going to do that. There's a lot of our videos and our channels that we'll never make a penny off of because of the fact that we don't do that. Um, we just like to let that music roll and, and we really appreciate the extra support that sometimes people will do. Uh, sometimes people will become a member of our Patreon yeah. and become a patron and that's at patreon.com slash grandparents react. And uh, those folks get to see all of our videos, the full videos without all the extra edits. And uh, sometimes there are some uh, exclusives that are on Patreon that aren't on, on uh, YouTube. So if you ever decide to become a patron, that's at patreon.com slash grandparents react. And that's one way that you can give us the extra support since we don't, most of, most of our we videos don't we don't make any money yeah. off of. <laughs> and uh, there's also that uh, super thanks but yeah. that's a way that uh, it, for anybody that has a YouTube channel, whether it's the, the group themselves or an artist or a YouTuber or a YouTube channel like ours, if you see that heart-shaped super thanks button, that means you can click on that and give them a one-time gift, like a tip that you can give and it, it can be a very small amount to say thank you to say thank you for doing that video and that also helps our channel yeah and um we also just recently started a cash app if somebody wanted to send us money directly to help uh, build up our channel and i'm scrolling on the screen now our cash app uh, account name and i think it's dollar sign grandparents react and I'll also put that in the, in the description of this video so you can find it there. But, uh, and also if you don't, if you don't have a cash app and you're thinking about setting one up, if you'll use our link, our coupon code, you can get $5 free from cash app. Doesn't yeah. cost us anything. It's just something that cash app does to say thank you for joining up. So there's that in our, in our, uh, description as well. And, um, our address is there as well, a mailing address if you wanted to send us something. So there's different ways you can support our channel, but just coming and watching and subscribing and sharing videos, all those Absolutely things are free and that really helps us out a lot. We really appreciate you all for doing that. And um, I think that's all. I believe you covered it. Thank you all for, for sticking around and chatting with us a little bit longer. We appreciate it. All right. Thanks, everybody. Peace. You're still here. It's over. Go home.